100 years old. My grandfather used to say that he would live until 100 years old. When I was a child and lived with him, I hated him. He was a dictator of my family. My grandmother, my parents, my younger sister and I lived with him cowering and flattering him because we were afraid of him. He wielded absolute power over us and nobody could oppose him. We needed his permission for anything. For instance, when I wanted a puppy, my plea was rejected because he said, this is my house. As a child, I thought his existence immensely violated my freedom and was hoping that he would not live so long. He liked going out and sometimes took me to a department store. It had never been a pleasant outing. He was stingy. He would go to a department store just for browsing without buying anything, wearing a ragged jacket and worn out shoes. For lunch, he would order the lowest priced dish and share it with me. And he would tell me to fill my stomach with tea because tea was free there. He couldn't make it to 100 and passed away at the age of 96. My family agrees that I'm the one who had the character just like him. Audiobooks by Hitomi Woods First audiobook, Japanese Dream by Hitomi Woods on sale at online stores or apps. Second audiobook, My Social Distancing and Naked Spa in Japan by Hitomi Woods on sale at online stores or apps. Apple Books, Audible, Google Play, Nook Audiobooks, 43 available distributors in total.